you're an animated guy. guy. You might as well. I mean, that's my brother. You know what I'm saying? That's that's all that has to be said. I can go into details about what we've been through, but you know, that's, it, he, we know where it's at. My cousin Alex, bro, this kid, the most fearless kid you'll ever meet in your life. He'll do things that have you scratch your head, and he won't care how you feel. He's gonna do it. He's gonna do 100%. He believes in himself, and that's such a big deal in today's society. Confidence, because they will try to tear you down quick. If there's something I learned in college, and just meet new people, there will be two-faced. They will just tell you what you want to mm -hmm. hear. And this kid, he's ready. I have no. There's like, there's nothing about Alex that scares me. There's nothing about Alex that's like, oh, you know, I, you know, I, oh, I hope this doesn't happen. No, man. I know he, he's just fearless to take care of himself. And I appreciate you for having me in line, man. There's a lot of things that I, I did because of you, man. I appreciate you. Like going blonde. That's because of you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so happy uh, that we yeah, take I just want to make this statement. I know that's that's that means a lot to you, no but it's just funny how music has always been a big role in my life and how at my dad's side of the family, I have a musician and Jennifer, who's a great one, by the way, and then I have a musician on the left side, who's a great one, by the way, and who's just as hungry. I got two hungry people for the career. So I have no time to let up. I have no time to lose faith or to feel pity on myself. Mm. Because I have two people on both sides of the family that's going hard for what they want. So that's just an inspiration in itself. So therefore, man, I love you, bro. You're everything to me, bro. The childhood as a kid, they'll never know. They'll never know. They'll never know. Until the movie comes out. Okay. Now my mom. My best friend. That's like number one, my best friend. I probably told her things that no kids want to tell their mom. I don't give a damn. That's my mother. That's my best friend. That's someone who I confide my deepest secrets, my deepest fear. Yeah. And lately, you know, I'm going to just keep it But Lately, I feel like I'm not the nicest to you. And I'm, I just want to apologize. I'm just, I guess it's a fade. I'm just stubborn for some reason. I'm trying to get out of it. But when I was a kid, there was nobody more I wanted to see than my mother. I would enjoy coming home to see you. I wouldn't, you know, like as I get older, I really understood you were 18 years old. You wouldn't even go to college, you went straight to Wendy's. And then from Wendy's, like three months later, you became a manager. From driving a Kendall to Little Havana. Now that I drive from J-Woo, I know that drive. And I'll, I'll be tired of coming back from practice. So I imagine you getting tired, which you had a little boy to raise, a black one. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious. You know what I'm saying? That's been tougher. <laughs> And, and, you know, and, and I, was, I was the one, I had the cousin, I was the one that for some reason was always in the wrong time, wrong spot, the wrong time. <laughs> and, you, and you held your own, you know, what you mean to me, what you mean to Leah, what you mean to Michael. You know, I've always said this, I feel like what Michael and Leah can't take away was our come up, because they'll never know that struggle of kind of, you know, living in like the other two houses in Kendo. And I just remember, you know, I remember there were times too, that maybe I wouldn't see you as much, but cause I'm, and then you were just working. You was working 12 hour shift at Home Depot, doing jobs that only guys would do, being pregnant and being on a forklift. I don't know why, but you know, you did what you had to do. And i never forget when you moved, it was so hard on me. I didn't want to stop you because I knew it was probably the better option, but I didn't want you to because I was just like, you know, I, I didn't know how things were gonna go, you know what I'm saying? But you're the best one in my life. You're, you have my heart. Uh, you know, every time you're mad at me or, or I make you feel bad, I don't go to sleep well. I always try to make sure we're on good terms. I love you for everything you've done for me, for everything you've done for the family. Like Tiana said, you're a caring person. Sometimes I wish I wasn't so sensitive, but you know what? I'm glad I got it from you because <laughs> look where you end up, you're a successful woman. Mm -hmm. You made a few, you literally, all mm -hmm. of your aunts started from the bottom. Yep. You guys came from Nicaragua, and you guys were kids. And you, every, each, each, each of you made your own lane, and you created something big. And we just created a family that will never be broken. This right here, what we got right here, will never be broken. No matter what, you know, drama or whatever, this, these moments will never be broken. Those moments as a kid that I have will never be broken. Moments I have with Greasy will never be broken with David, with Alex. Matthew, they will never be broken. And I just want to thank you for being that, that like, the captain to my ship. Mm -hmm. I have no problem with you leaving my life, because I know you're going to lead me down the right path. 
and I'm glad you like the angel. When I have bad thoughts, you, you clear them out and you just like the angel in my heart. Even when you're not here, I'll just think what my mom would do. You know what I'm saying? You're super nice that like, I just wish I could be half the person that you are. You are. So, you are. That's all I wish. You're even better. Yeah. And I just want to thank you everybody for coming out here. You know, I'm not doing this emotional stuff, so it's you that's stuttering, but I love all you guys. You guys mean so much to me. And man, let's eat. Yeah. yeah. Great job, Jay. Congrats.